welcome back to my channel welcome back to a brand new video today i have a huge cherries unboxing haul for you today so if you're into the bargain homeware finds then hopefully you are going to love today's video it's going to be quite a big one though so i've got myself a drink make sure you are set and ready with your own drink and snacks i've gone for the costa coffee sweet psychic double espresso shot caramel latte today so this is like a really cold refreshing alternative to a hot coffee today because i have already had one this morning and i just fancied something a little more refreshing quite sweet as well so a bit of a treat also i've got a new addition which some of you may have seen over on my instagram home workout this little kind of display floral dried floral arrangement that i've created and then the little range artichoke in front of it this i did on an event that we did with campus and bloom in fact i'll show it to you a bit closer up i mean you're meant to it's like a wall hanging piece but because i don't oh, excuse the slippers so yeah if you spot that new little addition in the background then now you know where it's from okay so cherries what is it if you've never heard of it it's basically an online bargain website homeware website which um we all know i'm a big fan of the bargain homeware stores and the fact that it is online i shop via the app super easy to do from the comfort of your own home honestly most nights i'll just browse the app to see what they've got new in and i do have a discount code for you guys so if you're brand new to cherries and never tried them before you can use the discount code freya20 which will get you 20 percent off your first order and if you like me are a big fan of cherries already and have shopped their app and website before then you can use the discount code freya which will get you free shipping amazing and if you want to easily see some of my favorites they have actually set me up a page on their website which includes all of my favorites so you can easily shop them i'll leave the link in the description box below for you to click through have a look see what things i've been loving and if you missed my previous feature that i worked with cherries on it was actually all pet specific related so i'll leave a link to that video just so that you can find it if you are a pet owner yourself and want to see what kind of things that they have that i've been loving on their pet section on their website humongous box biggest box i've ever had from cherries one pound sometimes even less than a pound a couple of pounds three four pounds um never really anything more than that so bargain lovers you're gonna love cherries if you've never tried it before so the first thing that i can see on top of the box is something for east so they do actually have an easter section this is going to be for a little diy that i have in mind i picked up this eight pack of glittered eggs so they're foam eggs with a little hanging ribbon i have seen on the white company i'm planning on doing a white company dupes video in fact if it's already live i'll leave it linked but i spotted these and thought these would be great for doing the little diy hanging um, egg decorations that they have like around table placing place settings or hung on the trees and branches and things and they're kind of like a little white speckled egg so i thought i could paint these speckle them and maybe have them as easter decorations for around the house oh i stocked up on a couple of uh like command strip type things for hanging that was the main reason why i bought it is you can hang that with a command strip there are a couple of items that are actually wrapped up i.e glassware which i spotted and straight away put in my order as soon as i saw these so they now have glass mugs which we all know i'm a fan of the glass homeware and the aesthetically pleasing cupboards in my kitchen so uh, yeah they've got these glass um like cappuccino size ones. this is the other shape that i got so more for like i would say teas or hot chocolate this one and this one's more of like a coffee speaking of coffee just have a little pit stop i think i picked up a couple of each yeah there's another one of the like t-shaped ones yeah and there's a second one of the like coffee shaped ones how nice are they i saw this gift bag this prosecco ho this is like around christmas time they do actually have a seasonal section where they have current season stock but also out of season stock so any kind of holidays or anything christmas valentine's easter they've got um a little section dedicated to that so i thought i would stockpile this for next year because it's so pretty this was in the valentine's section i'm definitely not saving it for valentine's i'm starting with these today uh wax melts in the scent sage and lavender 
which let me give it a whiff. I think I'm gonna love this. Okay, this is not overpowering in any sense at all. It's actually quite subtle. Sometimes lavender can be quite overpowering, but this is super subtle. I love that sage smell. It's so nice. If you like that kind of earthy scent, I feel like these would be nice to use in the kitchen, actually. Some cotton pads I use every single day to remove my makeup with micellar water. Oh, we've got a couple of spreads. So I've got the Skinny Chocoholic Spread. Skinny range is super popular at the minute this one is zero palm oil 92 percent less sugar they're basically like a healthier alternative and they do loads of other like syrups and things as well and then this is a new range that i have never tried this brand before it's from a brand called diablo which again has no added sugar meant to be healthier for you this again is a hazelnut and chocolate spread i'm gonna try these compare them out and see which one i prefer and diablo also do these on cherries which are the sugar-free chocolate chip cookies they have different flavors as well with like goji berries they had chocolate bars so yeah really eager to try those ones out and then skinny this brand also do jam so i got myself a raspberry jam it's my favorite flavor raspberry jam some bin bags i was stuck up on bin bags from cherries because they're i find the best quality the ones that i get oh my god where to we oh, there's just so much in here okay a couple of photo frames i think i got some other ones as well these ones are actually quite a good size to have just um like a small kind of print like on a desk or something so i picked up them another easter decoration type item i got is this silicone mold i'm gonna look it up online but what i was talking about the white company dupes little easter hanging decoration things maybe you could put some kind of like um clay or something in here to like set them and then glue them together so you've got larger ones yes so i got the photo frames in the black and gold as well little yankee candle this is a little wax melt in the scent a wedding day i think this is nice and fresh i used to have um a candle in this scent i got myself a bayless and harding hand wash for upstairs i've noticed that the hand wash that we have out currently is just like scented whereas i'm quite keen to get anti back from now on so this one is jasmine and apple blossom and like i said it is an antibacterial hand wash rather than just a nice smelling hand wash i got a little digital thermometer to go in our little medicine cabinet i'm excited to try this astonish do like a febreze style um cotton fresh fabric freshener so i've yet to try the astonish one so excited to give that one a try i think i'll put that in the bedroom oh our table has some stains on it that i've heard this is meant to be really good barkeeper's friend so i'm going to try that out and see if that will help remove the stubborn stains i need some new dishmatic refills they've got the heavy duty black ones i don't think there's much difference in the heavy duty and the regular but obviously they're black so better than green in my opinion kitchen roll this is my favorite one that they have on cherries they do have another one as well but um, that's the one I usually always get. Wait until you see the amount of Easter chocolate I have got. We are in for a treat. I also got some toilet roll. This is a nine roll pack. Oh, old school watchers of my channel. The people who used to watch my first ever Poundland hauls. Well, remember I used to wear or used to buy from Poundland the comfort bras that they used to sell. They stopped selling them so long ago now. Cherries now sell them. So they do different colours. I went for the nude, honestly, for like an everyday comfort type little crop top bra. These are so good. Oh, there it is. It's on the packet. Large. I got it in. I might pick up some more of them. Maybe in the white as well. I got some peanut butter for some rice cakes that I've got just as like a little afternoon snack. I've never tried this one before. I didn't even know they did it. But some pack do a protein plus one. 30% protein per serving. I got a little citrus juicer that they do in white for some nice lemon tonics, especially into spring summer. I bought this on a few of your guys' recommendations for helping remove pet hair on sofas. Apparently these squeegees, you just kind of scrape them along any kind of carpets, stairs, furniture sofas to remove pet hair these apparently are meant to be so easy oh i spotted another skinny skinny sauce in fact there's two here oh my god zero calorie i don't know how they managed to do that but zero calorie white chocolate zero calorie gluten-free fat-free 
sugar-free, vegan-friendly, diabetic-friendly. And then also I got a garlic mayo. I love a little a bit of garlic mayo. So the fact that we have a healthier version now is a win-win. I bought another drain and blocker. This one is the Mr. Muscle Drain Foamer. Just for upstairs in our bathroom, it's prone to getting blocked. So until we get a new system put in, um, I did pick up that. Okay, we've got Mickey. Another stock up of a fave of mine. And then I also got another one of these, which again is an absolute fave. This is the best cleaning cloth I own for mirrors, glass, doesn't leave any kind of dust particles. We use it on our like laptops and TV as well. I actually got another two packs of kitchen roll. We tend to go through it a little more often than we did before with having a puppy. I also got these from the seasonal section. These are gold gift tags. I think these were released around Christmas, but um, obviously, they're just plain gold. You can use them all year round. I got some dre dre <laughs> drain bleach, but I compiled that into one word. Bleach for our toilets. This I've never tried before. This is zero lime scale toilet cleaner in lime power. So I usually go for the pine one. So the lime might be a little bit of a citrusy kick. So I do love when you freshly do the toilet and you walk into it the next time you go in and it smells really nice. This is something that I thought could be a fun little um, thing to do if in a bathroom you've got one of those glass jars, you know, with like a lid on it, so you've got something on display. You can put cotton rolls in or something like that. If you've got a makeup station or, or a, like vanity where you get ready in the morning and you use sponges to apply your makeup, then they have this pack of 20 makeup sponges and this is by Forever Beautiful brand. So you could put a load of these in the glass jar and then also these ones that are like the kind of beauty blender style. So as and when you're finished with your previous one, you've got a fresh bowl on display and it's white as well, so it's nice and neutral. And equally, the cotton buds that they do when you just stock up, they have just plain white ones, which I love because again, if you're wanting them on display, like in a little glass, pot or something it's nice to have just all white because i know sometimes you can get them with like a blue so i think the johnson ones have got blue and they are the 100 percent biodegradable environmentally friendly paper stem ones that's why you get 200 in there i got another yankee candle wax melt this one smells really nice it's in dried lavender and oak again a nice transition into spring i got these little coiled hair bands that they do the kind of invisible style they had these in black as well i think um i just went for the clear again this could be another little um thing that you could put in a display jar bowl if you tend to use these all the time i do with my silk ones my satiny silk scrunchies but i thought a little one next to it could look cute with these little clear invisible balls so oh, i did get a chocolate bar from diablo okay i'm excited to try this this one is sugar-free dark chocolate i actually um tend to opt for milk or white over dark but uh, Tom really likes dark and if we're trying to be a bit healthier then dark is a go-to. I also got this, this one of my favourites for just like a quick and easy alongside like chicken or something um, dinner. This is the Ainsley Harriet's uh, Couscous Packs. And this one is in Wild Mushroom. This one's my favourite flavour. I've got a couple more of the Yankee Candle votives in Cinnamon Spice Cookie and Mandarin Cinnamon Tea. That one's good. Because it's got cinnamon in it, it's that kind of spiciness, but the mandarin is quite fresh. I'm trying to get everything done before I show you the amount of Easter chocolates that I've bought, because honestly, I have so much. Stock up of my favorite. Oh, God, honestly, this is like so good. If ever you go shopping, you just squeeze and sniff the top. The Lenore Gold Orchid is so good. I've also got this Febreze plug-in to replace the one that's in our hallway one, once that's finished. 90 days these last four, and this one is in Cotton Fresh. Quite like Cotton Fresh all throughout the house as we transition into spring. And i also got this deodorizing doggy spray. We have a Kiehl's one for Barney, but um, Kiehl's is like a nice one. This one's like more of just a, not every day, because we definitely don't use this every day, but like once a week or so. You know, like in between washers, we like to use this, and I just spritz it on his brush, and I brush him. Oh, I'm not gonna show Tom this, because he'll probably like hate the fact that I've bought a packet of macaroni and cheese. But for days that he's out and about, or out for dinner, at his mum's or whatever, 
this is gonna be my dinner. I think this is the last thing before some Easter chocolate. We've got a couple of coffee bits in there as well. Okay, so Dr. Beckman's is a brand I love using, and this one is called Stain Devils. It's a pre wash stain remover. If we're about to wash something and something needs a little extra TLC before it goes in the wash, we use the carpet cleaner. Um, obviously, he doesn't do any accidents anymore, but the first few days that Barney was here, he did. And then we pretty much nailed the toilet training after that. So, as and when he has an accident or brings in muddy paws onto the carpets, Dr. Beckman's carpet cleaner is so good. Pasta. Fun fact, I think Farfalle is my favourite pasta shape. After Tagliatelle. Love Tagliatelle. I know it's the same thing, but it does make a difference. Sometimes, like, Tom will be cooking and say, oh, should we have spaghetti with it? And I'm like, nah, fancy penne or farfalle. And he's like, it's the same thing. Please back me up and say, it's not the same thing. Pasta shape can completely transform a meal. Anyway, I've got a few coffee bits. got some new pods to try, which I'm excited for. These are Nespresso compatible. And I got one of the caramel and one of the lungo. I think they had vanilla or vanilla latte as well, but I just went for these two. And you get 10 pods in a bag. Yes, yeah, 10. Then I also got this. Um, these are like co cafe cafes. Coffee is like on the go. They're already pre done in a cup and they are with Coffee Mate. I love Coffee Mate. So it's a white coffee and just for like good on the go. And then I also spotted these. I've never tried these ones that they do before. Again, great for like if you're um, taking the dog out, going for a quick walk, and you make yourself a nice hot chocolate to take with you. What's going on with my hair here? desperately need to get booked in back with the hairdressers again i cannot wait so they are the maltesers hot chocolate again like pre-done in the cup you just add water or milk depending on how you like your hot chocolate and you get seven cups in each packet the rest is all easter chocolate this is full so i'm gonna rapid fire through what we did pick up Possibly Tom's favourite Easter chocolate, I think, is mini eggs. So I got three packs of mini eggs. And then I also got the little mini Easter eggs that they do the uh, dairy milk buttons one. Just a plain dairy milk. Love Cadbury chocolate. I think it's my favourite, actually. I also got a little Kit Kat chunky Easter egg. Oh my gosh, I've been so excited to try this. I've tried the little individual cookies and cream things that uh, Milky Bar do. And yet to try it, the chocolate bar finally found it so excited that cherries have these that's going to be finished today this we tried as well for the first time the other day and tom's definitely a fan of the milky milka milka over the cadbury oreo i'm still like a cadbury lover so he can have this uh, but either way delicious so i got this one for myself the white chocolate cadbury oreo so good i got a couple of um just kind of generic share bag type chocolates for i love getting these out for when we're having like a movie night this was some popcorn so i got the munchies cookie dough love munchies yet to try the cookie dough i don't think i've ever tried the cookie dough ones love cookie dough as well so i'm sure i love them yorkie chunks of course i've never had yorkie because apparently girls can't have do you remember that advertising they had like not for girls i don't know if they still do that um, anyway, another bag of mini eggs. These would be great for if you've got um, young kids or once you like an Easter egg hunt. They are like individually wrapped, which is handy. So the dairy milk dime um, Easter eggs and then just the standard dairy milk Easter eggs. We also have the Kit Kat mini eggs and then these little Kit Kat Easter bunnies, which are so yum. Maltese bunnies are my favourite though. Tom prefers these. I prefer these. So he can have the Kit Kat ones. I'll have the Maltese ones. Aero chocolate mini eggs. The Galaxy Enchanted eggs are so good. I mean, I'm going to say that about anything, aren't I? Milky Bar again, mini eggs. So yum. They do Cadbury's cream eggs, mini cream eggs, eggs. And then the Smarties mini eggs. And then last but not least, the Ritter Sport, which I always associate this with on holiday. I don't know why. There's always a duty-free section with Ritter chocolate in. Um, and I've got three different flavours that they do on cherries. So we've got the 
corn flakes that sounds good and then this one is the butter biscuit yum and the cocoa mousse with fine whipped cocoa cream i bet that'll be delicious as well so that is everything that i picked up on this occasion this fun little easter themed haul i hope you guys enjoyed it do check out cherries by the link in my description box and then you will be able to access my Freya's favourites page and also don't forget to take advantage of my discount code make sure you use that to save even more money off what is already a bargain haul so thank you so much for watching thanks again to Cherries for kindly working with me on today's video I hope you guys enjoyed it thumbs up if you did and now it's time for me to go put all this chocolate away thanks for watching and I hope to see you all again next time bye guys